Hey, what's up guys, I'm Nizio Cole, and Ubisoft just dropped a bombshell regarding Watch Dogs Legion, just randomly out of the blue, no fast forward event, no nothing, just dropped it on their YouTube channel and on their Instagram and Twitter. Uh, so yeah, I thought I'd talk about this. There is a crazy amount of information about the multiplayer for Watch Dogs Legion, but first I'm going to show you guys the actual video. Hi, I am Latish Slainadin, the live producer on Watch Dogs Legion. I'm excited to reveal our post-launch plans and to give you details about all the free content we are bringing you, as well as our season pass. On December 3rd, we will launch our first free update, introducing the online mode of Watch Dogs Legion, where you can explore the full city of London in up to four-player co-op and recruit anyone you see. We have all new co-op missions that you can play with your friends. Bring your own characters, find the best synergies, and build the ultimate co-op team. We're also adding dynamic events that will bring new challenges to the streets of London. On top of that, we're launching Tactical Ops, dedicated four-player missions tailored for co-op play that require great efficiency and communication. We also have our very first PvP mode. Spiderbot Arena is a hectic, high-intensity, free-for-all deathmatch for up to eight players. Control Spiderbots armed to the teeth and show your mastery. More PvP modes will be coming in future updates. We are excited to bring back Invasion, a fan favorite mode of previous Watch Dog games. Hack other players, keep your cool, or become the target. Online for Watch Dogs Legion is just getting started, and our post launch will feature exciting new game modes and surprise events. In addition to our online features, we will also be releasing free updates to the main campaign, including new characters with new abilities, new mission content, and unlocking new game plus. Let's get this over with. Up next, we are very excited to reveal more information about our season pass. Our new story expansion, Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline, continues the story of Aiden Pierce from the original Watch Dogs. But Aiden isn't the only star of his story. We're excited to announce that Wrench from Watch Dogs 2 will be joining him and will be a fully new playable character. Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline introduces a new storyline, new progression, and unique gameplay abilities. All Season Pass owners will unlock four playable characters, including Aiden and Wrench. Let me introduce you to Mina, a subject of transhuman experiments who possesses the ability to mind control individuals. And for one last big surprise, for the first time in Watch Dogs, we have a crossover with Assassin's Creed. Meet Darcy, a member of the Assassin's Brotherhood. All that and more will be coming to our season pass. There's much more coming down the road, including new game modes, old favorites, and a few more surprises. We are very excited to continue our Watch Dogs Legion journey with you. Stay tuned for more. So we're just going to get right into it. First off, the Legion Online drops December 3rd. So a few months after the actual game drops, which uh, kind of weird. I, actually, I wasn't there for the launches of the first two Watch Dogs. I bought the first and second game a little bit after the second game came out. So I don't know if they this is a thing that they usually do where they delay the online features from the actual base game uh, but let me know in the comment section below there are going to be fully fledged co-op missions which the way he described it kind of sounded a lot like spec ops from call of duty modern warfare there's going to be a new spider bot arena now the spider bot was something that we enjoyed in the first game they brought it into an actual mission in the second game and now it's its own eight player deathmatch and it's so cool and then invasion is also making a return which is nice to know something that he also mentioned was that there's new free post-launch missions so after the launch you won't have to buy any dlc to get these new missions of course uh in the last video for the last update that they dropped we talked about the watchdogs legion bloodline dlc that had aiden pierce but they're also just randomly just out of the blue like it was nothing revealed that wrench is also going to be in that mission as well as a new playable character and a crossover with assassin's creed that's just insane and the fact that wrench and aiden as well as the other two characters will be playable characters 
it just sounds like the coolest thing ever to me. Just imagine what Aiden will look like in RTX. Well, I can imagine, but those of you with 2000 and 3000 series cards, have fun. I have really high hopes for Watch Dogs Legion. Really high hopes. You know, as far as my thoughts about everything that just dropped, uh, so the multiplayer, all the multiplayer stuff, I think this is really cool because the first two games, you know, multiplayer was fun at first, but then I was, it got kind of stale. You know, there's only so many uh, heists you could do. There's only so many, so many things that you could do. But it looks like Ubisoft is trying to continue support for this game after, uh, it can, can continue adding features after the game is out and continue adding missions and stuff like that, which I think would be really, really cool. Because for the first two games, after, you know, it was a decent amount of content. After you finished the base game, you did all the multiplayer stuff, you maxed everything out, you got the two DLCs. But for this, they're just straight up planning on adding a bunch of new story content and possibly multiplayer content after the game comes out. So I don't know how long this will go on for, how long they're going to continue support. Because it just seemed like Ubisoft just dropped Watch Dogs 2 off dead really fast besides the the dlc and all of that as always let me know you guys' thoughts down in the comment section below and yeah this is just some crazy news hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys later peace